<laughs> Am I really holding this shit right now? Um, hey, come closer, come closer. Do you know what this is right here? No, sir. What is it? 100,000 subscribers, Inky. Oof. This is my 100,000 subscriber plaque. I actually yes, got sir. this like last month, but I told myself I wasn't going to open it right away. And I really don't know why, because I've been doing YouTube for like, what, three years now? I moved to Houston back in 2018, and I don't know, man. I've, I'm not close to anywhere where I want to be yet. Like, it may seem like I got everything right now, but I really don't. And I don't know why I didn't want to open this off the rip, but I think it's time to open this up and look yep. at it. Because I'm supposed to be hanging it up in my room, and Oof. it's just been sitting in my closet. Like, I don't even know why. <laughs> I think I was waiting for After Texas 2K, but after that little incident happened, I don't know, I was just like, man. We hit 100,000 subscribers like two months ago, yep. and I'm just not celebrating it. So, here we go. I'm just gonna open this up. You ready? Yes, sir. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Dang. Y'all, thank you so much. It means a lot, man. I wouldn't be here without y'all, so. F. Sheesh. God. Oh, that looks so dumb. Damn, bro. That's on fire. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do you remember your first subscriber? I really don't. You're 100 or you're 1,000 subscribers? Chances are you do. I really don't, I'm sorry. <laughs> I think it was my mom. That was my first subscriber. Ooh. Your fans may have found you while searching YouTube, learned about you through a friend, or maybe you showed up as a recommended video. No matter how they came to your channel, fans stayed and their numbers increased because of your unique voice and the excitement of being part of the growing community that you established. No, they, they, they. Damn. We are thrilled to see the development of your community and are proud to honor you, your impressive milestone of reaching 100,000 subscribers with your Silver Creator Award. Left me a little card right here. Congratulations on your milestone. Rick. Thanks, Rick. Who's, who's Rick? I don't know. Some guy from YouTube. <laughs> Keep creating, keep building. We can't wait to see what you'll do next. And we're here to support you along the way. And who knows, when you reach your millionth subscriber, yes, we may just write you and ask, do you remember your 100,000 subscribers? Yep. Let me take it out the pack. Hey, how did they do, they do it in, uh, in like, WWE? Do you remember? It was like, you ready to rumble? <laughs> <laughs> Damn, bro. You see the reflection on that? Yup. <laughs> Thank you, Mario, for passing 100,000 subscribers. For real, y'all. Thank you so much. Cool. Yeah, so it's the whole thing. Yeah. Perfect. Cool. That looks beautiful. Okay. Oh yeah. Telling you we're gonna build a killer. Yeah, killer. Building the killer. Coming from here, all the way back, the full suspension. This whole thing is about to come out of this. Uh, I'm so sorry about that, bro. Yeah. <laughs> um, Gotta be, look at this shit. Let me see. We gotta be very careful. Look at the K member and look at the fuel fitting. So we just need to be careful. Oh, I don't wanna have to take that off. My, right? Yeah. The, this is uh, for the fuel pump and the K member. So we gotta be is, very careful. That is right there. Um, nothing's gonna fall. So it's not gonna be like it's just gonna fall and snap it off, but we just need to be careful. Okay. So it doesn't fuck it up. But I need, to, I need to go up with the car a little bit so I can get a better angle. Go. Go. Jesus, bro, the whole thing's coming off. 
schlong. The whole schlong. schlong. Yo, that actually looks like a schlong, not gonna lie. Yeah. Dude, every time we take it out, we're always like, schlong dong! <laughs> Fucking schlong! <laughs> <laughs> that is pretty, uh, rotted though. Like, seeing all that come on. Go up. Go up. Here she is. Sheesh! There she is. Oh my gosh. There's like no way in the ass in. This is what has to be done since I didn't do it when everything was taken apart. Right there. Don't I have to? All I need is axles for the dragster, right? Well, like I mean, right now we're gonna like yeah, we're gonna take it to the dragster. I'm gonna have to slip the clutch, but I don't think I'm gonna be able to dump it without no axles, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> Both these axles. Be like, <laughs> well. That's the fake baby. When I took my car to the track, he was like, bro, just let her eat. Let her eat. Hold on, you got my clutch. Here, I got mine. Uh, that shit look about rustier than shit. <laughs> Anything off the rip? Not really. It's not even dirty in here. Hmm. I mean, it's fun to clutch, though. So, I mean, the clutch glazed over you know even if it doesn't even if it's not terrible or there's missing chunks it definitely glazed over which is i mean it's pretty much just toasted you know yeah the clutch Aww. so the clutch is fucking toasted <laughs> all right well at least i knew that something was wrong at least i i i wasn't tripping no, well, I knew that something was wrong too. When you told me clutch, when it stuck to the floor, you were, it was out of there. Yeah. Well, it's one thing when they stick to the floor, but it's another thing when you fucking got on it after, you know? Yeah. And it just fucking toasted it. Mm. It doesn't look too bad. It's definitely worn really bad though. How can you tell? All that. You uh, see how it's glazed? Look at the top. How it's just kind of glazed over. Yeah. On the track. <laughs> can I see the little, yeah, so uh, one hot spot, two hot spots. I mean, they don't even look like. It's got little ones right there. But see, the thing is though, when you feel it, it's smooth too. Like. Yeah, that's supposed look. to. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That is smooth. <laughs> it feels like glass. It doesn't feel like it's like the new like gritty. No, it doesn't feel grippy at all. It's just smooth. Oh, this is for my clutch. <laughs> I thought like it would be hard, like you know the RST and the Mustang. No, feel that shit. Shoo! It literally feels just like stock. If you want it harder, we can take the spring out, but if you like it like that, then we'll leave it like that. No, I like it like this. All right, yo, so we got new plugs in, new oil in, uh, putting some more brake fluid right now. We are bleeding the brakes. I'm all the way up here. Hold it. Pump it. I hate bleeding the brakes. Alright, you can take a break for a second. Uh. I was like, it's, go I was like it's going up. <laughs> I had to go up to unlock it. Gotcha. Got oil in it. Breaks your pump. Let me top off the fluid real quick. Should get power in there here in a minute. Hmm. There we go. Um, give me a second. Go ahead and crank it up. Start it. And make sure it's in neutral. Okay, go ahead. Ladies and gentlemen, the car finally has a new clutch in it. Now, 
We already drove it. I didn't film none of this, but we already drove it around the block, me and Fabian. And the car is feeling a little funky still. Like, I don't know. Remember how I said the car wasn't feeling right with the stock clutch? Like, when I was driving it, it just didn't feel right. It was kind of like hesitating a little bit. It's still doing that. I have a feeling it's some of my O2s. I don't think they've ever been changed since like 2015, so I don't know. The car drives, it's good. It's just like, it doesn't feel like how it should, you know? But, new clutches in, Monster LT1S. Again, thank you to Monster Clutches for sending me this clutch out. You guys, please use Martin 10 discount code right here. Get yourself a Monster Clutch because I'm gonna go ahead and run this deep nine second pass whenever my car is good, so. That would sound good. Look a certain way? I mean, it's kind of hard to say. I mean, you said they look toasty. Oh, they are a little hot. Yeah, they're hot as ball. I guess that's what it was the whole time. Oh man. <laughs> that's